as I drop off these tomatoes, I'll head straight to Carl's car wash. Betty? I'm here for a wash. Okay, what type of vehicle is Betty driving? Is it a car? Is it a van? Is it a tomato truck? Yes, it's a tomato truck. Let's see how messy that truck is. Hmm. A little messy? Medium messy? Super duper messy? Betty's truck is pretty messy. Let's set it to medium messy. Now, let's see what's got Betty's truck all messy. Hmm. Just as I suspected. What type of food made that mess on Betty's truck? Was it ice cream? Was it bananas? Was it tomatoes? <laughs> That's right, it was tomatoes. That'll be five tokens, Betty. One, two, three, four, and five. Here I go. Bye. <laughs> 
Isn't this exciting, Tom? <laughs> it sure is, Carol. It's a great day for a race. Why don't we take a look at the drivers? They look like they're ready and raring to go. Good luck out there, number three. Good luck to you, too, number two. Racers, on your marks. Let's go racing, you bunch of hot dogs. And they're off to a good start. Number one is pulling out strong. Looks like it's gonna be a tight race. It's a real game of cat and mouse out there. <laughs> Look at that! Number one has pulled out in front. Hello, number one. Number two is going strong, but she's going to need a lot more than that to win this race. Number three is catching up fast. They're about to go over the Rainbow Bridge! I give that a 10. Huh? Oh no, it looks like poor number three blew out his tire, Tom. And he was really catching up there, wasn't he, Carol? That's right, Tom. But look at him now, falling down the charts. He's gonna have to make a stop at the pit stop. Well, howdy. What can I do, you for number three? Huh. Looks like this tire needs a change. Looks like number three is back in the race. Number one and number two are neck and neck. Number one is in the lead now, but he's going to have to work hard to keep his place. What's this? Number three sure is coming up fast. That new tire is really working for him. He's neck and neck with number four. He's not gonna get left behind. And number three pulls in front of number four. Wow, look at that. Number three is really climbing the charts now. One and a half miles here to go on the racetrack. The fans have seen a good one tonight. Number three might actually win this one, Tom. He's passing the other drivers. There's nothing they can do. The finish line is in sight. everyone. Welcome to Super Simple Draw. <laughs> Make sure you have something to draw with and some paper. And don't forget that you can pause the video if you need more time. Let's draw a cat. Let's start with a circle for the cat's head. Next, let's add two triangles for his ears. And one more triangle for his nose. Let's draw some lines in his ears for a bit of detail. Two dots for the eyes. for the mouth. Cats have long whiskers. Let's draw three on each side. Let's draw a big oval for his body. Then add some little rectangles for the legs.
and a nice long tail for him to wave around. Now, let's draw two lines for the neck. We'll erase this line here. And this one here. And this one here. And one more here for his tail. Now let's add some stripes to his back. And give him a nice collar. Maybe he'd like some stripes on his tail, too. Now, let's color our cat. Should we make him an orange cat? Or maybe a gray cat. How about a black cat? That looks nice! Now, let's draw our cat doing what cats love to do most. Do you know what cats love to do most? You guessed it! They love to sleep. They'll sleep all day if you give them a chance. What else do cats love? Cats love to play. And a big ball of yarn is one of their favorite things to play with. So let's draw our cat a nice ball of yarn. And let's color our cat orange. with red ears, red stripes, and a pink nose. And pink inside the ears. And let's make the ball of yarn blue. Aw, he's sleeping. He's chasing the yarn. Cats sure do love yarn. Thanks for drawing with me. See you next time. Paper Puppet Playhouse presents Jack and Jill. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. <sighs> Whose idea was it to put the well on top of this hill? Phew! Jack fell down and broke his crown. Aw, oh, that was my favorite crown. And Jill came tumbling after. <laughs> Up Jack got, and home did trot, as fast as he could run. 
He went to bed with a bump on his head, but all in all, still had fun. Treetop family. Falling leaves. changing color and falling to the ground. Old leaves change color and fall off. And in the spring, new leaves grow. I found 
found Brown. We found all the different colors. 